Are you content with your current fitness level? Or do you aspire for more? It's a question we all need to ask ourselves. Why? Because the answer can be a powerful catalyst to kickstart a transformative fitness journey. You see, fitness isn't just about how many pounds you can lift or how many miles you can run. It's about enhancing your quality of life, boosting your confidence, and setting a positive example for those around you. So take a moment and reflect. Are you happy with where you are right now? Or do you dream of climbing higher, pushing further, becoming stronger? Maybe you're seeking more energy, better health, or a sense of accomplishment. Whatever your reasons, take note of them. They are your fuel, your motivation, your guiding light as you set off on this adventure. If you've ever thought about starting a fitness journey, this video will guide you through the process. Let's get started. If you're finding this video helpful, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Your support means a lot to us. It encourages us to create more content to help you and many others on their fitness journeys. Also, if you haven't already, consider subscribing to our channel. By doing so, you'll get access to a wealth of fitness tips and guides, and you'll be the first to know when we release new videos. So go ahead, click that subscribe button and join our health community. Now let's move on to the next step of starting your fitness journey, setting clear and achievable fitness goals. Before you start your fitness journey, it's important to set clear and achievable goals. This first step is vital because it helps to map out your destination. Knowing where you want to end up makes the journey more manageable and meaningful. Goals in fitness are just like any other goals in life. They need to be smart, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. Let's break down the concept of smart goals in the context of fitness. Specificity is key. Rather than saying, I want to get fit, a specific goal would be, I want to run a 5-kilometer race. This gives you a concrete target to aim for and makes it easier to track your progress. Next, your goal should be measurable. This means you can track your progress and see how far you have come. For example, if your goal is to run a 5-kilometer race, you can measure your progress by timing how long it takes you to run certain distances. Achievable goals are important. It's great to aim high, but if your goal is too lofty, it may seem overwhelming and unattainable. Be realistic with yourself about what you can achieve given your current fitness level, time constraints, and resources. Relevance ensures your goal aligns with your broader life goals and values. If you value spending time with your family, setting a goal to train for a marathon might not be relevant if it takes too much time away from family activities. Finally, make your goal time-bound. Set a deadline for achieving your goal to keep you motivated and focused. If you're training for a 5-kilometer race, you might set a goal to be able to run that distance in under 30 minutes within 3 months. Let's consider an example of a smart fitness goal. I want to increase my endurance so that I can run a 5-kilometer race in under 30 minutes by the end of May. Remember, the key to success is setting goals that are challenging, yet attainable. This balance will keep you motivated and excited on your fitness journey. Now that you have your goals, it's time to create a balanced exercise plan. To make the most of your fitness journey, it's essential to incorporate a mix of cardio, strength training, and flexibility exercises into your workout routine. Let's start with cardio. Cardio exercises are designed to get your heart rate up and keep it there for a period of time. They help improve your cardiovascular health, increase your stamina, and burn calories. Running, cycling, swimming, or even brisk walking are all excellent cardio exercises. You should aim to include at least three cardio sessions in your weekly exercise plan. Next up is strength training. This type of exercise primarily focuses on building muscle and increasing your overall strength. But don't worry, you don't need to become a bodybuilder to reap the benefits of strength training. Simple exercises like push-ups, squats, or lifting weights can do wonders for your body. Including two to three strength training sessions in your weekly routine can help you tone your muscles and boost your metabolism. Now let's not forget about flexibility exercises. These exercises are often overlooked, but they are just as important. Flexibility exercises such as yoga and stretching help improve your range of motion, reduce muscle stiffness, and prevent injuries. 
incorporating a few flexibility exercises into your routine, especially after a strenuous workout, can help your body recover and prepare for the next session. Creating a diverse and balanced exercise routine doesn't have to be complicated. You can start by alternating between cardio and strength training days, and then add in some flexibility exercises. Remember, the key is to listen to your body and adjust your routine as needed. Make sure to give your body ample time to rest and recover between workouts. In the end, a balanced exercise plan isn't just about hitting the gym or running a certain number of miles. It's about creating a routine that suits your lifestyle, meets your fitness goals, and most importantly, keeps you healthy and active. A balanced exercise plan will help you achieve your fitness goals and maintain your health. Stay tuned for our next segment, where we'll discuss the importance of nutrition in fitness. While exercise is crucial, it's only half of the equation. Proper nutrition is equally important. Just as our bodies need movement to grow and maintain strength, they also need the right fuel. A balanced diet can support your exercise regime and help you achieve your fitness goals. Now what makes up a balanced diet? It's a combination of proteins, carbohydrates, fats, vitamins, and minerals. Proteins are the building blocks of your muscles, while carbohydrates are your body's primary energy source. Fats, often misunderstood, are vital for nutrient absorption and hormone production. And let's not forget vitamins and minerals, the micronutrients that keep your body functioning optimally. It's like putting high-quality fuel in a car. You wouldn't expect a car to perform well with the wrong fuel, would you? The same goes for our bodies. The right nutrition can enhance your workout performance, speed up recovery, and facilitate muscle growth and repair. Remember, nutrition and exercise go hand in hand in any fitness journey. Finally, the most important aspect of a fitness journey is consistency. It's the glue that binds your goals with reality. Consistency can be the difference between achieving your fitness goals and falling short. It's not about making a radical change overnight, but making small, manageable changes over time. Think of it as a marathon, not a sprint. Sticking to the exercise and diet plan, day in, day out, is what will bring about the change you seek. It's about creating a routine, a habit, a lifestyle. A great way to maintain consistency is by scheduling your workouts like any other important appointment in your life. Planning meals ahead of time can also take away the stress of last-minute unhealthy choices. And don't forget to track your progress. Seeing your progress can be very motivating and can serve as a reminder of why you started this journey in the first place. Stay consistent, and you'll see the results of your efforts. Let's quickly summarize the key points of starting a fitness journey. We've discussed the importance of setting clear and achievable goals. This is your roadmap, your guiding light in your fitness journey. Next, we've established the need for a balanced exercise plan. It's not all about lifting weights or running marathons. You need a mix of strength, cardio, and flexibility. We've also touched on the role of nutrition. Remember, you can't out-exercise a bad diet. Fuel your body with the right foods and you'll see the difference. Finally, we've stressed the importance of consistency. It's not about being perfect, but about making progress, even if it's a little at a time. And that's pretty much it. Your fitness journey is a marathon, not a sprint. It's about making small but consistent changes to your lifestyle. Stay motivated, be consistent, and you'll reach your goals. Let's make this the year you take control of your fitness. Fitness isn't just a hobby, it's a lifestyle. It's the key to unlocking a healthier, happier you. And remember, every like, share, and subscribe fuels us to provide you with more empowering fitness content. So, harness the power of that thumbs up button, hit subscribe, and see the magic unfold. We want you to be of our fitness community. Leave your comments below, share your progress, celebrate your victories, and let's conquer our fitness journey together. Don't just keep this life-changing advice to yourself, share this video with a friend, and spread the wellness. Remember, no one ever drowned in sweat. We grind today to shine tomorrow. Thank you for stepping into this empowering journey with us. Let's crush those fitness goals. Together, we're unstoppable.